Okay, you gotta guess what this is. Alright. Ready? Yeah. Show them what it is. I'll show the other side. Okay. No idea. Looks, this looks like some type of ground. Still don't know. This makes rich happy. I don't get a steep peak. Nope. I'm gonna end you right now. What is it? Some type of old rock rolling looking thingy. I don't know. Looks like ropes. <coughs> Ready? Yeah. If you stand up a little bit, I won't get your head. Do you know what it is? I'm trying to find your hand in the viewfinder. What the fuck is this? No idea. Some type of antique. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> you know? I had to think about it for a little while. I'm not sure. A little phonograph type shit. <laughs> I don't know. Well, I'm on my way home from work Tuesday night. Point to that demonstration with the uh, people holding those points and not knowing what they were wasn't to make them look stupid. That's why I didn't show their faces. It was nothing like that. The point of the video is is they didn't do away with points that long ago, and already uh, the theory and the items have fallen by the wayside. And that's with modern day books. That's with the internet, and that's with you know old cars still being around. And the reason I say that is, I mean, when did they stop using points? Maybe 30 years ago, max, 25 years ago in some cars, and I think overseas there's still some running around. Um, the point is, is, you know, I watch a lot of the shows where they talk about, you know, the seven wonders of the world and the pyramids and all that stuff, and they say the only way they could be built was with aliens and this and that. That was thousands of years ago, with no written record, other than the pictures on the wall that they determined, or they deciphered to be whatever they want them to be, depending on what year we were in, you know? Did you ever stop to think that people haven't gotten any, any uh, smarter? Maybe we've gotten stupider? <laughs> I don't mean that as an insult, but if you can make the statement that a human being wasn't capable of putting rocks into a period and stacking them a couple hundred feet tall, Maybe we are a little ignorant, you know? Humans don't get any smarter, we just, in the modern day age, we just learn what other people did and move on from there. You know what I'm saying? People weren't any less intelligent back then, and they knew the way to do it. We just haven't been able to figure it out yet. So, that's the point behind the video. The point behind the video is things get lost to time. You know, it was back when they built those pyramids, it was no big deal. I mean, it was a big deal to move everything and to do it, but it was the method that they used was no big deal. And I think the thought process behind it is way too complicated, and that's why they can't figure it out. And depending on, you know, what show you're watching, they always leave the stuff in the background out of the picture. Because if you take one item out of everything you have in front of you, you come up with a totally different scenario. And that's what it is. They never show you the quarry. They never show you the half quarried rocks. They never show you the half made statues on Easter Island. You know what I mean? They never show you any of the good things. 
or that the stones were cut with lasers and they're granite. Meanwhile, they're not granite, they're sandstone. You know, but the point behind it is, is the people that had those points in their hands were anywhere from 20 to 23 years old. They have no idea what points are. They couldn't figure it out. Um, and when I spoke to them and explained to them what they were, I put them all in a group and explained to them what they were. And I explained to them how a set of points and a condenser works and a distributor cap and all the basics behind it. They still looked at me funny because they never heard of such a thing. You know, uh, they didn't know what a capacitor did. They didn't know any of this stuff. So that was really the point behind the video. The point behind the video was not to make anybody look stupid. It's just to show you how easily something can get lost in time. And that's it. And for you to look back and say, well, I don't know how they did this in 1960, you know what I mean? Going by the technology we have today, you know, we had, we had different technology back then and it worked just fine. And I know you guys didn't get a good look at the points, but the points that they were holding were out of a VW book. Donated for the experiment by VW Rich himself. So somewhere there's a customer out there that didn't get their new points, Rich. I'd find them, give them, you rob them. <laughs> no, they were used. They were used. They've been in this toolbox, I guess, forever. I mean, as long as I know them, they're sitting there, so. Rich does good work. Not for too much longer.